Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, I am Amy and thank you for joining in on this video. I'm guessing you guys are here for one thing and one thing only and that is to see my morning routine. Now, anything I do in this morning routine has not been fabricated. I'm not gonna lie to you and say that I get up before I am and start doing yoga in the middle of my garden because I don't. <laughs> Quite frankly, even though I should probably do a little bit more, um, and I don't make any weird and wonderful things. I literally just get out of bed when most people get out of bed and I get on with my day. I am a pro procrastinator though. So in the mornings, I like to keep everything kind of inspirational and kind of stick to planning for that day. If I plan out my day, I have a better day than if I just wake up and try to like jump into it straight away. The only thing I do have to say that I don't normally do is shower in the morning, shower, shower, I do shower, but shower in the mornings. I'm normally a nighttime shower, a shower. I'm a normally a nighttime shower, shower. I normally shower in the evenings. <laughs> There we go. Because I just love getting into bed like really clean. I just love that feeling. It's like fresh sheets every day. So that's how I feel doing that. Um, however, this morning I did have a shower because I did have a look to film and I needed to shave those pits. So, gotta do what you gotta do. Face tune can only go so far. So, anyway, I hope you enjoy this video and please let me know in the comment section below if you did. So my wake up time varies. I have been waking up naturally between the time of like 7.30 and 9 depending on how late I went to bed the night before and I'll always make my bed in the morning. I feel like if I make it then I won't get back in it and I just kind of feel like that means my bedroom is off limits for the day. I only have minimal pillows on my bed and I always sleep with my hot water bottle so that always sits there too and then my cuddly toys because yes <laughs> and I dwell and then I'm going to put on my slipper socks and do my 30 days of gratitude I got this from Pinterest so I can link it down below but I really feel like it helps you kind of be grateful for something in the morning I just write the hashtag around the outside and write what I'm grateful for so yeah it just puts you in a good mood and starts the day off well one of my favorite things to do in the morning is to open up those blinds especially if the sun is shining because i feel like it always puts me in a good mood after that i will always reach for the kettle and you're going to think i'm going to say a cup of tea but i'm not i'm going to make my morning ginger and honey drink i feel like this really settles my stomach um, if you suffer from gastritis or acid reflux this really helps I got this recipe idea from a book called The Gut Health Diet, which I will leave down below for you guys in the description box. So first of all, I just use my super honey, which has a vitamin C and also manuka honey. And I will pour that in the bottom of my mug. Then I will put the hot water in a jug with the ginger to the side for four minutes, just to kind of let it brew and just sit there. And then I will sieve it through a mini sieve, which I bought from Amazon. And I, yeah, just stir it. And it is honestly beautiful. It's got like a bit of a tang, but it's also sweet and it's very good for you. Then I will head into my office, <laughs> which is just basically a dining table in my lounge. I will leave you a link though in the description box because it only cost me £35 and then I like to use my diary that my mum got me for my birthday a couple of years back now. I don't overload myself, I kind of give myself one big task for the day and say if it's like sponsorship or something and then little ones like emails and uh, inspo boards or something like that. Then I will obviously reply back to emails and I will... Um, go through some content. I will reply to DMs also on my laptop. Then I will search through Pinterest to kind of give me some inspiration for that day, especially if I'm stuck and I'm not really sure what kind of look I want to do. This really helps and gives me um, a lot of creativity and just kind of guidance to what I'm going to be doing that day. Then I will check all my comments and stuff on Instagram and I reply back to as many as possible. I do try my best to keep up with everybody, but sometimes it is a lot, but I do my best and that's all we can ask for. <laughs> then on to my favorite meal of the day, which is really weird because I used to skip this meal, but breakfast is super important and I love having porridge. If you didn't know, on the sachets, you can actually pour the milk and I use my barista oat milk into the sachet up to the line, which gives you the perfect kind of quantity of milk to get like the perfect consistency with your porridge and I love doing my porridge in a pan on the heat I just find it's nicer um, than putting it in the microwave I don't know why it just comes out nicer and then I like to use a big chunk of chocolate spread to mix in with my porridge I like putting some seeds nuts um, chai seeds 
I like flax seeds, I like ground cinnamon, I just kind of shove everything on it and it is so tasty and yum, especially paired with my honey and ginger drink. It's just a really healthy and a, it's got a good load of calories in and it tastes incredible. Then I like to go onto YouTube and just kind of catch up on a couple of videos that are on my subscriptions for the day. I was catching up on Kate Hutchins videos actually because she did a morning routine and I just wanted to find some inspo for this very video. <laughs> As I said in the intro, I normally have a shower in the evenings, but today I decided to shower. So these are a couple of the products that I have been loving and using recently. I am doing a skincare routine soon, so stay tuned for that. Then I get ready for the day, which includes my skincare and then brushing my teeth, because you've got to keep those gnashes clean. I use the Philips toothbrush. My nan got me this for uh, Christmas, and then Ed got me the toothbrush heads, because these ones were thinner and I just preferred them. But yeah, my clean gnashes. Then I decided to use my bedroom as a filming setup for today. I have been preferring using my bedroom and I was gonna clean it all up, um, but I just decided to show you that I do have things on my wall which kind of reminds me of things to do or things that are in my head or on my mind. Um, it just kind of like helps me to kind of put it on paper and get it out there so it's not stuck in my brain. Then I know I don't pick my skin anymore, but you know, sometimes we have to. And instead of using my fingers, I just prefer using a tool because it won't actually push the spot like into my skin. It will kind of extract it professionally and properly. Then I decided to show you filming so I'll normally film and try and get that done ASAP during my day whether it's in the morning or at lunchtime um, just so I've got time to edit it to get it up. I will then attempt to take some selfies I was just doing this for special effects guys I don't actually wiggle this whole time and I was also on FaceTime at the same time. Lazy girl problems my ponytail started falling off so I just kind of held it in place for the photo shoot. <laughs> So after I've done my photo session, I will go into my lounge and I will go through all my images to see if I've got one that is uh, decent and that I'm happy with to upload on Instagram. Being realistic, this is probably entering lunchtime now, but I thought I would also include this. But I do start to import all of my footage from either a YouTube video or Instagram video onto my laptop and I will start to edit. That day I did a lip tutorial ready for Instagram so I'm just importing that and starting to go through the footage and picking out the best frames to use for my video. Then once I have edited that up I will then go into my bedroom and clear up the mess ready to end my morning and have my lunch which is around like 1-2 so this is probably filmed up to about 2pm and yes yeah, so thank you so much for watching this video please give me a thumbs up if you did enjoy and I will see you in my next one. Thank you. Ha, ha, ha.